my name is Dr. Ebony Vincent, and I am a 2015 graduate of Des Moines University College of Podiatric Medicine and Surgery. And I am now an attending physician with clinics in Long Beach and Orange, California. So I always wanted to be in the medical field. I knew I wanted to be a doctor since I was like 13. I just didn't know what kind of doctor. I um, have my own experiences with having ACL surgery, so I was introduced first to the world of orthopedics with my own injuries. And then I decided I wanted to be the kind of doctor that could fix things that I could see. During my post-baccalaureate program, I was able to shadow tons of physicians. And in doing so, I shadowed a few podiatrists and really got to see their day-to-day. -day. I got to see surgical procedures, I got to see their clinic experience, and then I got to see them living their lives and being very happy with that. The profession as a whole, it's very rewarding because people love you. People love their podiatrists because you're absolutely able to make a difference. And I think that that's why I went into healthcare because I definitely want to make a difference in the lives of people that I'm treating. You definitely have to have a level of empathy and are able to put yourself in your patient's shoes in terms of what their desires are and how to get them to where their goals are. As a DMU student, Dr. Ebony Vincent played an important role in developing several diversity, equity, and inclusion initiatives that we now have in place. She understood then and now the human side of healthcare and the important role diversity, equity, and inclusion play in serving her patients. Dr. Ebony Vincent, thank you for your continued dedication and commitment to the guiding principles of diversity, equity, and inclusion in the pursuit of health equity. The world is a better place because of people like you. We are vital parts of the medical community at large. I think that we are almost like first line of treatment when it comes to a lot of patients with other illnesses because a lot of times patients need their feet in order to get healthy. My most rewarding uh, position as a podiatrist has been the opportunity to essentially showcase what we can do on the show My Feet Are Killing Me on TLC. That was an opportunity that just pretty much came out of, out of nowhere, which I was happy that it did. And I think that it definitely is showcasing podiatry in a wonderful light. I hope the show lets people know that they can go to their podiatrist, that you don't need to be afraid. We've probably seen something worse, so don't be embarrassed. And we can fix you, we can help. When I think about Ebony Vincent, perseverance comes to mind. Anytime she was confronted with a challenge, she always accepted it and worked to overcome it. Her terrific personality and energy come in part from her competitiveness as a Division I athlete. She also is a reflection of the positive values her parents instilled in her. She's been involved in many activities to promote the podiatric profession as well. We were really fortunate to have Ebony choose Des Moines University. I can't think of a more deserving person to receive this award. I think that the impact I have on patients' lives is pretty incredible. I think that that's one of the perks of the profession is that your patients will let you know how much they value you and appreciate you. When someone's foot hurts or if they can't get around and walk and then you're able to make that happen for them, their lives are forever and completely changed. I would like to thank the DMU Alumni Board for electing me as the rising star of 2022. It means the world to me. I am so blessed and thankful to be a part of the DMU family.